Last night, the Sumter community came together to say goodbye to Nevaeh Adams and Cherie Bradley. The mother and daughter were killed in their home two years ago. Balloons were released to commemorate their memory. News 19's Eleanor Tabone has more. They go on, but their memory still lives. It's the tragedy the Sumter community will never forget. I miss Cherie and I also dearly miss Nevaeh. Today, remembering five-year-old Nevaeh Adams and her mother, Cherie Bradley. One, two, two three. Cherie Nevaeh! Love you. They're up there in that beautiful sky with the Lord. But I just want everyone to know that I love my daughter, and I love my granddaughter. Police believe Nevaeh and Cherie were killed at their home at the Lantana Apartments in Sumter by 29-year-old Dante Johnson. Johnson was located a short time after the killings. Sumter Police Chief Russell Rourke in attendance. He remembers working the case and the scars it left. An event two years ago changed this community. It changed our police department. It has left uh, scars on the hearts of many of our officers. Nevaeh Adams and Cherie Bradley was brutally murdered in their home. For Nevaeh's father, Dupre Adams, the emotion just got to be too much for the still grieving father. <laughs> because we represent my baby. It's still fresh, like it was yesterday. Police found little Nevaeh's remains in a landfill in Richland County, two months after the murder. They say Johnson confessed to killing them both with a knife. Johnson telling officers he dumped Nevaeh's body in a nearby dumpster after the killings. During this 10 years, I've seen a lot of tragedy, but nothing measures up to what we have witnessed two years ago. A week doesn't go by where their names are not brought up in a house. In Sumter, Eleanor Tabone, News 19 WLTX.